Angel Spirits Guides, what is going on in love today for Cancers? Um, Angel Spirits Guides, what is going on in love for Cancers today? Remember that these are general messages. You are to listen well. Take the ones that apply to you and leave the messages. Leave the rest. Let them fly. Thanks for liking this video, sharing, commenting, and subscribing. Somebody missing you or thinking about you. Somebody is stuck on you. What's going on in love today for cancers? Angels, spirit guides. Someone, someone is feeling tormented. Angels, spirit guides. What's going on in love? Someone wants to be by, be with you. Angels, spirit guides, beloved ancestors. What's going on in love for cancers? So. Let's see which one of those energies we're going to be exploring more of. Okay. Oh, gosh. More messages of love. Yeah, Pisces. You could... Be, this person could be a Pisces or you could be thinking of a Pisces. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. This person missing you, talks, wanting to talk with you, watching you. All right, what's going on with this Pisces in love for Cancer? It's Angel Spirits, guys. I think this person is watching you. What's going on with Pisces? Or defame? Or someone wish that they could defame you? I don't know. What's going on with the um, hangman? That's some. There's a negative, a negative energy there. What's going on with the hangman card in love? Like someone thought that they could control you in some way what's going on in love for cancers yeah but this person i hear hereditary they're realizing that they cannot control you five of yeah temperance this person is getting to realize that you are an earth angel you're dynamic you are multi-talented you may have four different talents or you're like the avatar where you are a master of four elements or you're well-rounded that is what someone is realizing about you you know how really rich that is for someone to be realizing that you are a master all right or you're an earth angel chariot this person that was trying to mess with you is realizing that they shouldn't mess with you i don't know if they realize it yet but they will i hear sleep Someone may be trying to mess with your sleep, your name, your stability, your mind, right? But they can't. So who is this person? Yeah, this person is a jealous, angry, karmic ex. Or it could be like a group of them, honestly. It could be a group of them like your, your ex's family. What do they want? I feel like they want to torment you or they want your place. They are so jealous and karmic. You are in Queen of Pentacles energy. Someone wish that they have your state or your place. They're literally trying to torment you or tease you so you feel uneasy or uncomfortable where you are. They want your money too or they want your man or something, your job, your position. So tell me more about the Queen of... They want your love. These people, these people are this person. They were so, so, so jealous of your love. They were like jealous of your love or your money or your state, your position, your status. If, if you were with someone and this person was putting you up on a pedestal, there were people looking on, even some of your ex-friends that were jealous of the position that you were in as Queen of Pentacles. So let us look more at the Queen of Pentacles. But the, yeah, as the Queen of Pentacles, you were real rich. You were the Empress. You want for nothing. You probably didn't even work. You get everything that you needed and wanted. You just sat on your throne. Every everything was alright. And some of them was jealous over you over someone that you were with that was not even all that. You're like the boy or the girl ain't even all that. You can go with them. Like you're doing too much. Alright, so let us see what 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 position you are in the most i want you to know something let's see the most i want you to, to know that you win like um strength and the page of cups it's giving me like you're the most powerful there's something about a binding now someone thought that they could bind you going something about books or spells yeah someone thought that they could block you bind you for true in real life okay this is what this is a message from like most i all right so strength card and the page of cups 
Yeah, but yeah, look, high priestess. This person thought that they knew spells or they could tie you up or bind you. Yeah, this person, this is who they are, page of wands. This is who they are to you, like in comparison to you, who is the queen of pentacles and the, and the empress. This person is page of wands that thought that they were going to compete with you, compare themselves to you. Okay, and one in your place. This person was trying to copy you, literally. Like, this person was trying to do everything that you did so that um, like they could take your place. It's in real life, I'm telling you, that was going on around you, right? Mm -hmm. But what is happening for you? Most are saying that you are protected. Let's see why and how. Why are you so protected? Look, Ace of Swords, that's the truth. The Most High God, clear sentient, clear audience, a child of God. This is why you are protected. With your prayer, you may be praying more, reading more, using your will, your intention. This person thought that they were more strong-willed than you and they could speak over your life and you. Whatever they said of you, that is what you would be. Okay? And because you are also a bad, you know what, full of life, love, and possibilities. That is also why um, you are protected. Because you trust your intuition and you move when you have to move. You know, you take action when you have to take action. You have integrity um, with your spirit. So let's see how you win this one. How you win. Yeah, page of diamonds is how you win. And the king of swords. So you are blocking right now you're protected and your money is your money is you're yesing your money more to come more you're yesing it more forward that's how it feels like with the king of pentacles it feels like you're just you're yesing your money you are affirming it you are the one that's telling yourself like yeah and my money is coming through my health my wealth my stability um mr so not just money but your confidence your energy your good feelings your good energy your intelligence your information you know you are the one confirming and affirming and approving yourself right now forward like everything that you want to come into your life you are saying yes it is you're not asking paul and harry or whatever and sally and there's so, i think someone is up mad about that but they're gonna have to stay mad but let's let's move on this message is kind of maybe you are you're thinking you wanted some some positive messages but it is positive this is this is something that was coming from an ex something someone named Paul to an ex that thought that um they just they could manipulate you control you they thought that you were easy to manipulate easy to control but like I said they didn't realize that you were a master of the elements all four you are the magician you are the alchemist whatever energy that this person was sending to you you were turning it around and making the best out of it this person didn't realize that you could play too you could play with energies too like i'm telling you i hear read a book okay yeah four of ones this person was trying to stop love from entering your life this person was trying to stop your love, your good love, your blessed love, your harmony, your peace your, around your home, your 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 connections, your family, you getting good um energies coming into your life in luck, in fortune, compliments, money, in how you feel about yourself. But right now I'm feeling like this person is realizing that it cannot work. The mind games don't work. Um shalom no more. Yeah, look, the mind games don't work. Seven of Swords. Mind games, Seven of Swords. Seven of Swords. These people, <laughs> these people were playing mind games. Sharp. Sharp. These people thought that they were sharper than you, Nancy Drew. But they didn't, like I said, they just didn't realize that you were skillful. These people just, they, they thought less of you because of where you come from, how you look, where you grew up what you have from what you don't have income they were comparing themselves to you and telling themselves that they have more juice or sauce or life or connection to spirit or than you it's like the little the little drummer boy or something like they just thought that you were a country girl or something so you didn't know anything and they could do things to you they could play around and try to manipulate you okay and you wouldn't know game but this like i'm telling you you're having your happily ever after outcome peace harmony love okay this person is afraid though this person ten of swords and the tower 
this person is afraid that um things will fall apart that is pro that is one of the reasons why they are still watching you they're afraid of the truth being exposed on the media by you. They're afraid of your throat chakra healing. They're afraid of your third eye opening. They're afraid of your heart healing. Because when that happens, you're letting go of something that was holding you back and preventing you from living how you are meant to live. So whatever emotions that you were holding on to, This person wanted you to keep holding on to them so you did you couldn't move on someone wanted you to like not be able to move on because you moving on meaning that for them it felt like it is like you found the truth out so you're having a release them finding you finding the truth out means that you you release them or you know the truth about them and they can't have that they can have it be where it we've established that it is the truth about them look so they don't like that they don't like that you're holding your own right now, whoever these people are, this person is. And you see, the more you speak up, the, more, the, the looser their hold on you is. And they know that too. And they know that you're not wrong. So I just feel like you're waking up. Yeah, you're, and your money. These people were like lying on you to defame you, going back to wanting to defame you, to block your happiness, your fortune and your success because they're jealous at how blessed and fortunate you are and how good looking and how things work in your favor. I hear Penny, Penny, someone could be named Penny, Penny something, Pennywise or Pennyless, okay? All right, this, this, these people are this person, they, they wanted you to feel sad. All right, something about your mother, without your mother or something. These people were talking about you. These people were talking about you. Queen of Wands, Empress. These people, Page of Wands. All right, these people, Fool Card. All right, King of Wands. Okay, Four of Swords. And they thought that you wouldn't, you didn't know. Okay. Mhm. Mm they thought that they were higher, sitting higher than you. You wouldn't hear anything. You wouldn't know anything. So let's see what's going to happen. Yeah, you're, you're breaking away. That's a song. Like, you're breaking away from the holes of these people. That's what's happening right now. Awakening, awaking up with the tower card. Yeah, you're breaking away. You've done it already. You walked away. Eight of cups, follow your own heart. You, you're just moving away easily, casually, nicely. You're not depending on these people or this person anymore. This person thought that you'd continue coming around to them for them to be the source. They thought that you were dependent upon them, right? These this devil person. Then they have an, they have other people um, dependent upon them like that too, right? But you are one. You're the one that got away. You're the smart one. You know, you're the one that didn't want to remain leaning upon this person, and you're the one that they want to come after. And then they try to come after you with like lies and manipulation, trying to tell people lies on you, going back to them wanting to defame you so that they can get you back. That was a, one of their tactics because they were afraid. They were afraid of what would happen when you walk away, when you pull away, when you're free and when you know the truth. Because you being free means you're living your truth. You living your truth means that the truth about them is also exposed and they can't have that. This person wanted you to come back. This is like giving the energy of um, so, uh, some type of a parent that keeps children and gets and get money to keep them. You know what I'm saying? Um, but if you are one of the youths that leave now, I don't know, like adopted, like an adoptive family um, or something like this. But you are one of the youths that decide to leave. So you leaving means that this person wasn't treating you right. That's what it's like. You walking away is like if this person, if this young person would choose to walk away to go be by themselves rather than stay in this home with this person that is portraying as being good, then people are going to know that that person is bad then. So they want you to come back so that or, or so that they can say you are the bad one or something like that but that's not gonna happen that's why they're panicking and that is why they're also trying to come around not to try to appease you you hear me that's what they're gonna do if they don't do it yet 
that because they want you back this person is a snake this person is moving like a snake this person is moving like they don't know better concealer sealer woodpecker this person is acting like they, this is the only life they've lived they've just lived this underground life and they don't know how to act any better this person could be a crim boss yeah judgment this person has answers to answers questions to answer too like judgment courtroom law this person has done things that they need to answer too and they over here trying to get at you instead of it, they go pay mind to their own business okay um instead of like trying to keep you blocked and stuck all right so what is to come for you son that is the truth the truth and they've been exposed all of them and they know it too okay they know it and it is showing it is showing lovers yeah truly it is showing and this is your energy because like i say true love is coming for you and it is you know what's gonna also be showing for you the fact that you were right to move away into self-loving to choosing you and you're gonna find real love so it's like when you're in a real love energy people other people are gonna witness that too that's one of the reasons why they also didn't want you to go re be with someone else because when you're being when we're you're with someone else that other person is treating you nice you look good you're leveling up it that also means that they were the bad person and that, that's why they don't want you to move on but you're gonna find true happiness you're doing the right thing be more patient with yourself right now be loving self-caring right be um you may be feeling emotional Things are going to turn around for you. Alright, keep working on your good habits. Good habits. These are going to attract to you better things in life. Better positions, better state. Better feelings. Alright, so love you. Take it easy out there. Someone is thinking about you and maybe wanting to call you or call you back. And this person is also wondering why you're not calling them. Alright, in some way. They're wondering why you blocked them, why you're not speaking to them, why they're not hearing from you. This person, they want a turn with you or a chance with you. Or they've been feeling like they've given a chance or something. They think you should give them a chance. Some. Alright, but single, I feel like I'm reading for single people mostly. Or some people are choosing to be single or deciding that they'd like to be so yeah, take it easy and I'll see you in the next one. Thanks very much for watching this video. Like it, share, comment, subscribe and I'll catch you in the next one.